Hello, you guys. It's Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. So here's my friend Chelsea. And we are going to do um, two recipes today. One's going to be the chicken enchilada casserole. <laughs> Someone had requested that, and so we're going to do that. I'm using my new tripod, so I feel like I'm in outer space. But anyways, we're also going to do better than sex cake. So <laughs> she's going to be my assistant, and I'm going to be her assistant. So, you know what? She even dressed for the occasion. She's just beautiful today. Look at that. Amazing. <laughs> so let's get started, Chelsea. All right. The first thing we need to do is we need the can of pineapple. But you got to cook it on the stove, so you might want to move the cake, babe. Awfully bossy this morning, you guys. I am bossy. Amy, we've been here 10 minutes, and she's putting me to work. I know, right? Don't you love Gosh. it? True friends. <laughs> um, we'll put your ass, I mean, you're, we're going to put you to work. <laughs> and that's going to take a cup of sugar. Don't we want to tell them about the holes? Yeah, we can do the holes while we're cooking the... Oh, okay. She's never made this, so bear with both of us. So you're going to heat that up a little bit. See, you didn't automatically start it like you did last <laughs> <Nice> week. <time. laughs> last week, she just started our, our stuff up, so... <laughs> I'm going to flip the camera around so you guys can see me stirring the pineapple and the whole poking. And I'll hold it up for your camera. Yep, absolutely. Look at her. Fancy. Mine is not fancy. <laughs> <laughs> I told her I feel like I'm in outer space because it's looking down at me now instead of me going like this. So we have a can of crushed pineapple and how much sugar? Chris? One cup. And one cup of sugar. And we're going to heat this up together, uh, boiling, right? Yep. And in the meantime, I'm going to, she was gracious enough and already went ahead and made this yellow, yellow cake, cake mix. And you want to poke <laughs> holes in it? You're a hole poker. I am going to try really hard to not <laughs> touch that one right now. <laughs> This is honestly, you guys, um, a girl taught me this recipe years ago, and it is to die for when it's done. See all the holes in it. Amazing. She did really good poking holes. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> I will put the recipe down later, and then I will send it to her, too. She's such a good little cooker. Aww. I'm so impressed right now. <laughs> All right, so I'll be back once this is, how long do we boil it for? Just till it gets hot. You just want it to spread over, so. Okay, I'll be back for the next step in just a second. We'll be back. And we're, we're back. We're back. Okay, so this is boiling, and then you want to shut it off, right? Yes. yes. And then pour it on top of the cake. And spread it all over the whole thing. Spread it around. Doesn't that look yummy, you guys? I'll bring it over. Hold on. I can't believe how much farther out I can see with this new thing. Yeah. I'm getting fancy dancy, guys. I still don't know what the hell I'm doing. She's moving up in the YouTube world. <laughs> All right. So then what do we do? Now the next thing is we're going to do the pudding. So, you want a bigger spoon or a littler spoon? I like to be the little spoon. Okay. <laughs> now, this is vanilla pudding, and I could not get the six ounce box, so I had to get two of the small ones. Do not go by the instructions. Use three cups of milk for both boxes. And then just put it on top? Yep. Smear it all over there. Doesn't that look pretty? Mm -hmm. I want to lick the bowl. <laughs> I know that's a bad thing when you got kids because the kids want to do it too. And you're like, no, that's not me. <laughs> I don't know what else I got. That was the bananas. And spread that out. Doesn't that look yummy already? Mm -hmm. And now we were talking about a dessert. And I said, better than sex cake. And I go, she goes, all oh, that. And I said, no. The other version. She hadn't seen it, so. Yeah, I've never had this version. My version is chocolate and 
caramel and, and candy bars and yeah it's really good <laughs> i can't read this <laughs> might want to turn your camera around honey i've got it um oh okay on the cake. all right now we're going to slice up bananas is it doing it doing it and doing it again I have a knife for you. I'll even help you. Oh, how nice of you. I know, right? We figure if the other one does it while we're, you know, because it's something we haven't done, then we both learn how to do it, right? So then we become experienced. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and then you guys wished that you could honestly have taste a vision through this because, oh my goodness. Is it amazing? I'll have to take April a piece home. She's working all day. I know our spouses like to do all that overtime. And sometimes they don't have a choice. Mm -hmm. Look at that. I was telling her earlier that when my son got married about eight years ago, um, his wife, she goes, well, you can make that one cake for the wedding because they wanted to make sure they had enough past the wedding cake. I've got another banana here if we need it. And, um, but I was like, it's called better than sex. And so we ended up calling it, what did I tell you? Um, banana, banana split cake. Yeah. <laughs> and the whole cake got ate. There was none left. So, <laughs> Tom's in the background. There wasn't even any crumbs left in it. And there wasn't. It was so. Do you want this whole banana? Yeah. Or do you think Go ahead. Okay. Go ahead. Let's get banana -ny. Let's get bananas. Banana nini. I'm sure that's not a word, but that's okay. <laughs> I'll need another small spoon. I have such a hard time sometimes with the, the names like that because she's Chelsea. I have a Kelsey, a uh, Katie, and a Courtney. <laughs> and I'm like, it's like almost being a mom again to the girls and have to go through the list of names. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when your kid's in trouble, yelling at them. No, no, not that one. <laughs> Mine's always Chris Pop. <laughs> and they're like, we have separate names, Mom. Now, we're going to put on whipped cream. Who doesn't like whipped cream, right? Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Use the whole entire thing. This is not the cheapest of cakes, but it's the yummiest of cakes. Should have got to put it in a bigger pan. Holy moly. It'll be fine. Look at all that. Mm -hmm. And believe it or not, my husband doesn't like whipped cream. Oh, there's something wrong with him. Can't be trusted. No. Can't be trusted. Seriously. <laughs> cannot be trusted. He doesn't like coconut either, which is next. Oh. But um, he will eat that because he loves this cake. Spread that around, baby. I know it. Mm -hmm. So delightful. I'm making a Look mess. at her. See, Hot I'm just mess. Look at that, though. Hot mess. Finger express. looking good. <laughs> you don't have to do this, but I like to do it. Look at. Look at her. She's so fancy. <laughs> okay, now, before we do the next step, um, I didn't use to put chocolate on it, but because we, you know, made it into the one cake. If you can put that in the microwave just long enough for us to melt that up. No. And then click on. <coughs> Look at, she's learning everything. I'm so excited. I'm so smart. <laughs> now the next thing on there is coconut. Coconut. I even love the smell of coconut. You know, my parents, when we were little, they used to buy us coconuts and they'd break them open and we could eat them. Oh yeah. I loved them. You know, you could keep eating those forever. Like, because they're so tough. 
to mm -hmm. bite into. Maybe they did that to keep our mouth shut. Could be. Could be. <laughs> you know, I never thought of that until now. Maybe that's why the cake was coconut. The coconut first and lemon chocolate or? Yep, yeah, coconut and the cherries first. Then we the drizzle the chocolate. Oh man. I'm gonna let you be fancy and drizzle, baby. Oh yeah. She does it so nicely. Did you ever make pizzas for a living? No. <laughs> really? Because that's how we get to do like that. Tom does this. Clump. <laughs> it's really quite funny. How much coconut do you want? That's good. Okay. Isn't that beautiful, you guys? Yum. I'm just going to test the chocolate. See what? Shh. Shh. I know. it's It tells on me all the time. Maybe 10 more seconds. That's going to hurt her feelings. You have to do the cherries. We got um, pizza last night, or pizza, ice cream last night. And I said, no whipped cream, but I want my cherries. Tom got them to put like four cherries in a little tiny cup for me. Wasn't that so sweet? Aww, Tom. I know. Wasn't that adorable? I punished her. Because <laughs> she didn't give me any. So I didn't give me more. He's in the background. He's afraid to come out into a kitchen with two women. Imagine if my sister shows up. He's really going to be intimidated. Yeah. Last last week, what do you say? Um, I know. I know my I know, limitations. I know my limitations. Yeah. <laughs> so this is not super melt like, and I'm afraid if I microwave it anymore, it's going to seize up. Try it. Just ten more seconds. It'll be alright. Okay. If not, then I guess we're not putting chocolate on it. Well, if, do you have milk in your fridge? Yeah. We can just add a little bit of milk to There's it. There's some milk in there if you want it. Chelsea's learning everything about my house. I'm so <laughs> impressed. I've only been here. This is my second time, and it's like I just... Oh, you know what? I'm going to put this on right now. I forgot. The nuts. I act like I live here. She does, too. It's okay. <laughs> you know what? Honestly, when you have company... I'm putting um, chopped pecans on there, by the way. When you have company, you want them to feel like they're family in the area, their home. My rule at my house is you're a guest one time. Exactly. And after that, don't be expecting me to wait on your hand and <laughs> <Right. play. laughs> And honestly, I live with the, the thing that my grandparents taught me when I was a kid is you never go home hungry. Mm -hmm. And I have stuck with that my whole life and I don't understand when people get invited to homes and they don't ask them do you want something to drink and if it's meal time and they cook they're cooking dinner why they don't offer not most people don't do that but I do know a few that don't I'm like how can you do that <laughs> you weren't raised right that's why <laughs> oh my gosh I got chocolate all over her microwave that's okay hot mess that's all right it's meant to clean up. <laughs> That's like I tell Jack, you know, when he does that, I'm like, and he plays with his food, he hates it so bad, and I'm like, you can clean your hands. <laughs> yeah. We still have soap, and because of the, you know, that other thing, we have tons of antibacterial soap, so I'm sure you're good. But you gotta put your, your cherries on first, babe. Well, you stir that. I'll stir it. I'll stir. Ooh, chocolate. You know, when I crave chocolate, I should just come out and melt some. Mm hmm And just eat it by the spoon. <laughs> I like to mix peanut butter with my chocolate and melt it oh, and yeah. eat it. That is so good. <laughs> you know, that kind of stuff is why I'm a big guy, right? <laughs> just Same. <saying. laughs> I'd rather be chunky and happy than skinny and miserable any day. Yeah. I'm going to try to get a few pounds off, but I don't want to give up everything I like. And I think when you do that, you crave it even more. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? I think so, too. Look at her decorated. We should have put initials and stuff in there. I'm kidding. <laughs> I listen, am so kidding right listen, now. Listen, <laughs> I ain't doing all that. <laughs> Isn't that pretty? Mm-hmm. Looks yummy. There, now we got the chocolate queen right here. Oh, yeah. There you go. Let's see. I don't know how well this is going to drizzle, so. You can drizzle however you want. 
Oh, it still looks good no matter what. Look at that. See now, by doing this for being my assistant, she will know how to do it just like that next time. And then hopefully with her husband. <laughs> <laughs> Up till come back a couple times and teach me. You know, mm -hmm. I'm not as quick. Mine is super easy. My recipe. <laughs> We're doing this one just because it's really, really good when it's cold. You want everything to be chilled out on it. But it really looks like we should eat it now. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Well, the chocolate drizzle isn't as pretty as I would like it to be, but you know what? Who cares? It's chocolate. I know, right? <laughs> chocolate is not a bad thing. Oh, I'll look at them. <laughs> then I'll be wanting the cake. Oh, no. This is why we do dishes in between, because I leave to make such a mess. All right, doesn't that look good, you guys? This is going to go in the fridge for how long, Chris? Just a couple hours at the end. All right, and um, we'll see you guys back when it's time for... Dinner. Lunch. Dinner. Lunch. Yeah, whatever. whatever it happens to be. Liner. <laughs> Liner. And, Actually, um, that's a mess I used to always call it. Oh, really? Time for liner, because Mark worked a different shift. So it couldn't be dinner, but couldn't be lunch. So she called it liner. Oh, wow. So we'll see you guys back for liner. Absolutely. Bye, guys. <laughs> so there's the better than sex cake. Is it better than sex, Tom? <laughs> <laughs> Don't answer that. You're going to get in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> I refuse to answer on the mounds of the rounds of the main critter. <laughs> We it think. Is it good? It looks good. really good. I haven't taken that bite yet, and I cannot wait. Look at that. You mm. guys have a blessed day and be a blessing.